Hi, I'm Bonnie Browning with the American Quilter Society, and we're here at AQS Quilt Week in Phoenix, Arizona. Joyce Treisenberg from Grayling, Michigan, is a third place winner in the Bed Quilts Innovative. Innovative. Bed Quilts Innovative category. And so, Joyce, congratulations. Thank you. And let's just talk a little bit about your quilt. Okay. First of all, uh, where did the design come from? Uh, it was the Quilt Shows Block of the Month for 2012, and it's designed by Sarah Vedler. Okay. And, and you told me there's something unique about this design. Yes. Um, it has nine, it's divided into ninths. So there are nine points to the central star, and there are nine mariner's compasses going around, nine areas for this applique. So that's unusual. And typically we'd have eight, eight. wouldn't we? Right, yes. right. And so what, did that make it harder or easier? It made it a little strange. <laughs> it was different, <laughs> you know, wasn't it? We're all afraid of set-in seams, but this quilt had nine set-in seams for every round. So that was quite a challenge. Well, I bet you learned how to do them. <laughs> I <you>? sure <laughs> did. I had lots of practice. <laughs> all right. Now, I know you used some unusual thread to put this together. Right. A lot of this is appliqued with rainbows, variegated threads. And I used two different colors. If I was appliquing a blue section, I used one color. If I was appliquing the red or the brown, I used another color. And then I used um, Metro embroidered thread, Pro, Metro Pro thread for all the other background quilting. Okay, and, uh, and you used what kind of batting? Uh, Hobbs 8020, just okay. one layer. Yes, because you do have some nice definition where yes, it, it stands out nicely for you. It came out well. And I also used for my stippling just tiny feathers instead of uh, circles or the normal stippling in well, these corners. Well, obviously the, the judges thought it was a beautiful <laughs> quilt and deserved an award here at this show. Okay, thank you. Uh, so congratulations again, and we hope we'll see more entries from you.